All right, guys, we're back trying to crack the safe here. I died. I lost the mission, so I joined an online match with some co-op so I could have some help from real people. If you check out my glitch video, you'll see what happened. My AI guy was carrying this safe, the data that's in this safe, and he just froze. He wouldn't move anywhere. Check out that glitch video, and you'll see what happened. I figured you guys didn't want to see losses. I figured you'd want to see the matches done how they're meant to be done. Um, I mean, if for some reason you do want to see losses, let me know. We can definitely make that happen. Um, I just figured you guys would probably want to see the, 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 the missions won, but let me know in the comments below if you do want to see them, you know, the losses as well, just just get a more realistic picture of Brink or what. I figured for this 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 third episode, though, we would make it a little bit more like this. I'm redeploying here right now. So they they return the data key. We have to go get it, pick it up, and take it to an, uh, like a data hive, which is so far away. Um, and I'll actually change guns here, like we talked about last episode here. So I'm going to go, I'll, I'll pull out the Drognar of Light Rifle. I tried this as a... Uh, is a resistance fighter, and I'm going to show you the Tomahawk pistol as well. I've, I tried this out when I lost, and it is crazy! I love it! It's my favorite gun in the game so far. Um, so, we gotta go get the data key, but I hope I can go show you how much damage this pistol can do. Um, the problem with the AI a little bit is, as long as they're not anywhere near as smart as you want them to be, so like, okay, yes, that's a that's a pistol wreck. Um, you can see it sounds really cool. Unfortunately, we're getting owned by the other people, and I died. And you lose all your health. The enemy does too much damage to me, then we die. Um, I'm playing co-op right now, which is interesting, because you can play co-op or versus, where you can play versus where the enemy only, or like the, the human players can only be your friends, or they can also be enemies as well. Like, uh, it's, it's kind of cool. You can play a totally solo, co-op, or totally, totally multiplayer. I mean, this is the, the Gerund or whatever. It's like a, there's no sniper rifles per se in Brink, but it's, it's basically as close as you're going to get. It's like a, a one-shot thing. I'm not really the biggest fan of the gun. Um, but it does do some pretty solid damage you can connect. It just, it feels like the hardest gun to aim. You can see we can... Oh, God. Oh! Let's get out of here. I'm actually gonna go... Well, when we die, I'm gonna change guns back. Because I don't really... I don't know. I don't really like this. Hey, Jack Hambit, have a gun. Ow. Yeah, now we're dead. We've got 12 minutes to save this data key. And it's tough, man. It, it's. I'm glad that Brink has challenged, though. Otherwise, you know, you do the 10 missions and be out of here real fast. But... I tried to resume it at just the point we stopped last time, and I think I did a pretty good job. So, this should be a pretty good episode here. Let's let's complete this mission. I've gained a lot of XP um, from, you know, dying, so we should be able to rank up, I think, soon. And actually pick some pick some skills, some perks, you know what I mean? We're going to go with the, um... Go with this one, the cross SMG here. See how this does. Now, hopefully, because we have a couple of real guys, obviously, like, Chang is computer still. Um, AI, but but we have some real guys. So I'm hoping we're gonna be able to do some damage here. Or go to take this thing. Hey, let let me capture this together. Let's capture the command post. Normally I don't do this, but I'm trying. So let's see. All right, that gives us extra supply, so we can do more things like more uh, more mines. Ow! Ow! Whoa! 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 Who's doing that? Where? How did they get behind us? That's what I want to know. Goodness gracious, I'm, I'm dead again? Whoa! Like, the, the the computer enemy AI is really good at grouping up and, and teaming up on you. And, like, the human force just doesn't seem to stand much of a chance against that. Alright, let's let's go with, um... Let's go with Medic. Because, uh, we can then hopefully buff our health, give some guys some buffs. Where's that other dude? Where's he hiding? Hey. Get away, there we go. Where? I don't see him. Okay, we, so, the chiefinator has the data. Good, a human has the data. That's all I care about. Um, because we can't we can't have a we can't have a, a non-human get it. Because if you watch my glitch video, like I said, see what happens when the computer gets the data key. They just stand there and do nothing, and you can't. There's nothing you can do to make a move, which is awkward and weird. Uh oh. Hey, here's an enemy. Whoa, 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 dude. Okay. No, you don't look like a fascist. Mm, boost your health. Have some health boost. Hopefully, we can do this. Let's. Make a move on the data hive here. It's tough. You're gonna see like these are the tough ones. This is tough in resistance. When you come on these like big, big areas where there's so many guys at once, like it becomes tough. Now this time, see the enemies just all spawn in because we're right by their spawn. It's dangerous. Danger, 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 Will Robinson. Okay. Hey. Don't don't kill my dude. We're trying to save. Oh God. Where are our medics? I'm a medic, but. Okay. You, grab it. Grab it. Put it in. Put the data key in, and Medic, come save me. Come save me. You're right there, Chang. Let's go. Run and run and run, and this is kind of nerve-wracking. Like, we... Yes! Boom, baby! We won. Outstanding. 
Now we can stop whatever Jen's plotting and capture the bastard before he tries anything else. And the little teamwork, we get the job done the right way. Good job, whoever you were. I don't even know. Who was that guy? Let's see. Who helped us out? Jack Hammett. Thank you. I appreciate it. Okay, now we did get some new stuff. So what I'm going to do here is we'll exit the main menu and we'll use the rest of this episode to show you guys and show me, I guess, for the first time our customization. So now we have abilities. Oh, gosh. Okay, so we have five level credits here and we're going to spend these. Um, we can do this with, with these things. You know, we unlocked all these universal abilities, I believe. Okay, so we obviously have some basic ones. And then we have all these that we can we can pick out here. So, again, there's so much going on in Brink. Um, it just takes a little bit of time to get used to. So you have universal abilities, which are probably good ones to do. Grenade shooting, shoot down your own frag grenade. What? That's crazy. Battle harden increases your life meter. Okay, supply max increases supply. Reload on the run. Throw grenades. Sense an unseen enemy. Weird. Third person while you're capturing... That's kind of good. We have five points here, I think. Right? No, oh, wait, wait, five or two? Okay, we have five. Oh, but those can only be used at, like, level three. I see. Okay, so these can be used, like, at level two here. So this is the soldier. We spend a lot of time as the medic. What does he have for perks? Metabolism, teammate health, refill supply faster, buff a teammate so they ignore all damage for a short period. Mm, that's pretty good. Increase supply. What about the, uh, the engineer here? Oh, turrets. I want to do this. Plant the turret. We're buying that for sure. Yes, I want to buy that. Okay. And what's this? Give your teammates additional armor. I want additional armor for myself. How fast you can build and repair turrets. Okay. Hmm. Do you want to upgrade that? Let's uh, let's give some... What are, what are the universal ones? I say we... Bo why don't we boost our health? Why not? Let's just boost our health a little bit here. Um, and then we can... What? Sprint reloading. Perception. I don't know if I really like, like that one. What about for the medic? We got three more points. I mean, I, we could wait till we level up, and so some of the I, they all cost one, I guess. We could save our points. Um, but I kind of want. Does the soldier have like a Kevlar vest? Armor piercing ammo upgrades. Oh, well, let's do this. Let's buy that. Okay, good. I don't. I, I kind of like switching classes, and it seems like it's a good idea because you need different things for different situations. So I don't want to commit all my points to one area, if you know what I mean. But as you can see, there's lots of perks. Operative. I don't know how I feel about this guy yet. What does he do? Command post. Nah. Iron sighting. A enemy. Sticky bomb. That's kind of cool. Every enemy's location will be showing your teammates' radar. That's pretty good. Let's buy that. I'm sure we're going to use that in the future. All right. We'll save a level credit just in case when we level up, we want to use something else. Uh, but now let's go. We can customize weapons as well. I think here. Oh, baby. There's a lot of stuff going on. So we can totally. What do we have to do? Are these challenge bases? Oh, they are. Okay. So there's a lot of things we can unlock. We don't have any yet. They, they doled out kind of nicely. I like that. I like that they doled out nicely. Let's check what we got for our... What's up here? Body type. Okay, now we can be heavy. Dude, should we be a heavy guy next episode? Let me know in the comments if you want to see a heavy guy. He's slow. He can't climb well. I heard light guys are pretty fun, so I'm excited to be them. We got the bug pants. What do those look like? Yeah, that's kind of goofy. We'll stick with the shield for right now. I think we'll stick with the shield. I'm pretty satisfied with that. Our guy looked pretty good. There, we have an ability point. So there's apparently levels, ranks, and level credits. So you rank up, I think, every five levels. There's only 20 levels in the game. But every five levels you rank up, and yeah, then you can access these level five powers, which, like, if you see, it's like a Gatling turret, or what's this? EMP grenades, disable enemy turrets and mines. Let's check out all these. Lazarus grenade, aerosol bomb, revive all teammates, sweet. Satchel charge, remote control bomb. So there's a lot of good stuff. Down fire lets you shoot and you're incapacitated. Uh oh, second chance. No, a bad perk. Um, but there's a lot going on. It seems awesome. Thank you very much for watching. Stay tuned for more Brink Security and Resistance, bringing it all to you real fast. Hit that like button if you'd be so kind. I greatly appreciate it, and I'll bring you Brink even faster. Thank you very much once again for watching. Have a fantastic day, and I will see you later.